been kind of up and down season at times, and now we're we're into kind of crunch time with it. Big home finale against St. Paul's on Friday. Just kind of where are y'all right now? What's gone well? What do y'all need to clean up to accomplish some things these last couple weeks and beyond? Uh, we all just trying to come together as a team, man. You know, we've been playing well. Offense playing well. Defense playing well. And we all just trying to glue together and be one. And right now, we're just working on different things right now. Just to make sure everything come together and we be prepared for tomorrow and less mistakes and equal a better win tomorrow. Has that been when, when y'all have games get away from y'all? It's just been a mistake here, a mistake there sort of thing? That yeah, most of our losses become from mistakes. It's really having a team just really just beat us. It's really been off of mistakes, and we uh, fixed a lot of our mistakes, and, you know, we became a better team throughout the season. What is it going to be like tomorrow for you all to, I mean, potentially your last home game, certainly the last one of the regular season, you all senior group. What's that going to be like? Uh, it's going to be great for us. You know, everybody just coming ready to play. He's going to give us a chip on our shoulder, come out here and play hard and get a city what they want to see. And, you know, come out here and have a good time and come out with the dub. Your season has been huge in terms of what you've been able to do, getting pressure on opposing teams' quarterbacks. What's going so well for you and your role in that defense? Uh, really my team. My team helping me come out and play a good time and, you know, get to, after the quarterback, you know, just work on my moves and, do what I do best and go get the quarterback. What I was really on the team to do is go get the quarterback. When you talk about your moves, is there like a, a piece of that toolkit that you feel most confident in? Yeah, I feel confident in my speed rush. You know, just get on the O line and you know use my speed, speed of power. You know, just do what we was told for. We were talking before you. You were way off in terms of how many sacks I think you had. Yeah. Right now. You, you were giving yourself about half credit. Yeah. What is that like to hear that you're? having that type of a productive season, whether it be for you to kind of leave a mark in your last year here or what you're doing, bringing to this defense, just whatever it means for you to have that type of performance. Um. That that I just look at that in the interim, but right now I'm just trying to focus on the season. But if it, it, it feels good to have that many sacks, you know, and you know, just helping my team get the win. And most of my sacks just come off my team and helping me, you know, get to my spot. And everybody been in the right spot and help me get that. So it works on the DBs. They been in the spot, locking up their uh, position, and me getting to the quarterback. This is what I do. You hearing from some schools a little bit right now? Now, now the only school I'm really hearing for right now is Mississippi Valley, but I'm just taking time, letting it come to me. I asked you a little bit in the spring, I guess, but what do you hope that schools are seeing, whether it be performance-wise or when we have these conversations or if they come by and, and chat with you, what do they need to know about who Jamal Sapp is as a young football player and a young man? They just you know I bring a lot of energy to the team, man. A lot of we have a lot of I have a lot of fun, you know. I'm gonna come out here and play on Fridays, but outside the lines, I can go. I be myself, and I don't really take everything serious. I just have some time and have a good time on and off the field, and then I come on the field on Fridays and play hard. And when I was here, Albert was banged up, so he was, he was frustrated trying to get back. What's it been like having him back? Oh, it's always great to have a three on the other side of the field. You know, it's like my twin, so it's two demons on either side of the field, and it's hard to block us. Like I said at the beginning of the spring, that the other coaches got to prepare for us, and we just go out there and play and do what we do and see how what kind of season we having. Both having good season, and just gonna keep going and finish throughout the season and have a great season.